experiencing hyper uh, We chose total experience. Actually, I hope we gusto ko mong total experience kasi um, yung parang nickname ko po ng The Voice was the total performer din. So gusto ko mong ibigay sa kanila sa concert na to yung total experience naman. Um, so including yung mga, yung nga sabi ko dancing, yes. then will you be playing like another instrument? Or? Um, not this time. Okay. <laughs> okay. And then ano sa tingin mo yung pinaka-significant change or difference na ito doon sa more uh, concert last time? Yung concept po nung uh, concert ko last year sa Moa was kind of like a birthday celebration. So, ito naman po parang I want to show the people what I have more in store of. So, yun po yung papakita ko naman dito sa T-Total Experience. And uh, meron mga surprise na nalabas or? Um, we'll see. <laughs> so in your whole career, syempre, you've been singing. Meron ba ang time na parang feeling mo nag-iba yung boss mo or do you think it's still the same till now? Syempre po na um, throughout my two years so far here po, naramdaman ko na din pero naabot ko pa rin po yung mga pinakanta ko po noong nakatataas pero I'd say my voice is changed in a better way kasi kumapal po siya na mas buko when I belt. Thank you po. Approach mo personally si Maha for the concert? Um, di po. We, uh, we talk to our handlers kasi uh, fellow Star Magic artist din po siya. So, actually, tuwa po ako nung sinabi niya, ano? Sorry, Bonnie. <laughs> Sabi niyo po, sigurado po siya kung gusto niya akong makaduit. So, natuwa po ako din yan. Another thing I'd say kasi yung relation naman po namin, Pareho po kaming pinaka-awarded na performer of the year, so, yun. Meron kayo kay dad show down there? Abangan nyo na lang po. It's parang sing and dance. Tapos napansin ko dun sa album mo, meron ka track na 7 minutes in the environment. If you will spend 7 minutes with someone, may dream of. Siyempre po, well, my family. Ba't po yung family? Ito ba't mga anak? I don't know. Actually, hindi ko po alam. I'd say besides my family and my friends, siguro yung... Sino ba? Dianatics din po. Kasi they've always been there since they want to support. And I just want to give back the in those seven minutes. Info. Thank you. Congrats. And one more thing. Ah, uh, sino yung isa pa parang for you? Na parang uh, same as same na talagang na total performer din na uh, gusto mo magkasabay. Gusto ko pong magkasama sa road talaga. Um, si Sir Gary B. Opo. Chaka. Siguro po si Ate Sarah, kasi Ate Sarah na yung mga hindi doing the same duets pero gusto ko rin po siyang makasama sa sing and dance, if ever. Ang taas ng pangarap nung <laughs> ano naman po, pero yun po yung mga talaga kong dreams ko. Congrats! Salamat po! Follow up to uh, Red Strand from Collectors. Follow up lang po sa rin. Sa mga international uh, singers or celebrities, sino yung gusto mong in the future yung maka-duet or maka-duet or maka-duet? Um, alam ko pong 
hindi na po ito posible, pero si Michael Jackson. Pero kung na, ano po po ay pareha? Hologram. Oh, hologram. <laughs> And then, pero kung, yung nandito pa rin, si Bruno Mars po. Or si Beyonce din. Thank you po. Hi, Darren. Hello. Uh, Darren, you mentioned kanina yung Darren natin. Mm -hmm. um, sa, kasi ikisa ka dun sa artist na may talagang pinakamalawak na <laughs> fan base dito oh, sa Philippines. Uh, ano, in your opinion, ano sa tingin mo yung meron ka, aside from your talent of course, na bakit ganun ka sinusuportahan talaga na itong mga fans mo? Ano, ano meron ka? Uh, I guess it's just being who I am and yung pagiging simple lang po. Yun po. Do you interact with your ano? Uh, fans uh, regularly. Paano yung uh, relationship mo with your fans? Sa so, most shows po, I like to go down and sa meet and greets po, pinakamusta ko rin po sila. And then, also on social media, I do Ask Darren's and nakikipagpulitan lang po talaga ako sa kanila minsan pag nasa comment box sila. Sasabihin nila, oh, nag-comment si Darren sa akin. Sasabihin ko talaga, mga ganun po. So, Um, I'd say I'm pretty close with the Dernatics team. Last question, kasi na-mentioned kanina that your your voice is parang maturing, it's becoming oh, okay. very deep, uh, very yung deep. Yung tawag voice ko po nung last year kasi, talagang matinis ako na ganito. Oh. <laughs> eh, medyo parang buko na nga. Oh, okay. Will this influence yung, 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 yung musical style mo in the following years? Uh, do you see it influencing, uh, eh, giving you a, a new direction when it comes to your style? Mm -hmm. Uh, I'd like to continue yung mga genres po na kinakata ko po ngayon katulad ng mga ballad tsaka pop pero siguro, if ever syempre po hindi na po sa sa parehong nota ng panta, siguro bababaan ko na po Thank you Thank you po Hi Darren Speaking of Darren Katanong po na yung viral photo kanina mo Okay po. Uh, what's your reaction doon sa yung, yung fan na nakakarta sa ito? Uh, <laughs> Actually, kasi po yung nakakarta ko siya, tapos hindi po ako nakaabot doon sa heart niya. Pero yung mismong photographer po nun, uh, sorry siya kasi, yung ano ata, hindi po na-capture yung pag-heart ko. Pero um, alam naman po nila na Nakart din ako. Tsaka yung, <laughs> yung girl din po, nag, ano din siya, nag-post na yun nga, nakaheart nga ako, pero hindi na-capture so sayang. And, ayun, I just like, kasi nakita ko din po may mga nag-react na mga media na medyo ano daw ako sa fans ko, yung parang hindi ko po sila pinapansin pag ganun. Ano, parang get the story right before you, you judge someone. Parang like, Yun po. Yan, yeah, I think nakita ko rin, pinuntan ko talaga yung Facebook page ng MC Ibis. Uh -huh. May mga pictures ka naman. Nakaheart ka talaga with, oh, the, with the other fans. Yeah. Naging connotation tuloy is, anong tag ito? Pang one side love. Kaya <laughs> kaya. Oh, wala rin po memes eh. Yun, na lumabas. Okay. Thank, Thank you, Darren. Darren, uh, wala pa ko for you wanna you wanna try the acting kasi mga kasabay na sa the JK nagsusulat ka rin na pas. Oh, I, I was supposed to be a part of the movie nung MMFF po pero kasi yung schedules ko po talagang wala na po available availability so yun po uh, ayun ayun <laughs> Pero you're open to that you're willing naman to do so for movies in the future Yeah, opo Okay Uh, another controversy, yung backstabbing uh, post uh, mo din. Baka pwede natin uh, makuha din yung panic mo itong okay sa backstabbing issue na ito. Sige po. Um, well, yung backstabbing po kasi, it's... It's unfortunate kasi, the, you know, the people you trust the most, minsan sila pa yung gagawa ng mali towards you. And, One thing I learned na hindi lahat ng nakangiti sa'yo are going to be nice or are trustworthy. Yun. Yun. Ang hugot ba? Okay naman. Thank you po. Follow up na. Question ko lang. Kasi from last year's concert, sinabi mo, ano, nag-cardio, training ka pa dahil 
yung yung ano yun para pag sumasayaw hindi masyadong hinihingan ni singing dance ko so are you also doing more exercise ngayon dahil ngayon nga may upcoming concert and also very busy kanta ka ng kanta I try to find time din po bago kumain minsan so like in before breakfast I like to do jumping jacks or just run in run in place run in the run on the spot yun po and then um just regular exercise. Chaka para din ako din po nagpa-perform. So through that, na na practice ko parin po yung breathing and I get to work work out din in a way. Kada how do you cool down naman after let's say after the concert? Nila di worth mo ba yung sa dili mo ng bakasyon, ma ilang weeks ba o ilang? Um, medyo kasi po pag ano ba? <laughs> Nakabook na po parati pero pag gusto ko naman po uh, kahit one week minsan pinapablock up po pero yung kahit afternoons na pwedeng magtagig sa umaga or sa afternoon basta nakablock up yung umaga or afternoon okay. Hi Darren uh, Let's see uh, for um, dinner in the sick uh, Um, I, I know you actually uh, sang already in Carnegie Hall before. So do you plan to like explore Broadway or um, even the local musical theater scene here? Actually, po, after the Boys Kids, Tita Lea Salonga had an offer for me for a Broadway debut in New York, I think. And then she trained me after the Boys to like in, in dictation for theater po, tsaka yung pagkanta. And when we said it, nagustuhan naman po ako ng mga taga, I think it was King and I or Prince and I. So, yun po yung, yun po yung sinalihan ko. And they wanted me to fly there para mo makasali sa, sa play na yun. And unfortunately, yung schedule ko po ulit yung medyo book ano yun fully book na yung schedule ko po ulit kaya hindi, hindi rin po yun natuloy ulit mm. okay just a quick follow up question how how do you see yourself um 10 years from now in your career 10 years from now it's kind of hard to say because i don't really want to look into the future but i'd like to say i'm still in school and i'm still pursuing music Thank you. Thank you. <coughs> Ay, sige, uh, kung mapapalaw na lang ako. <laughs> <laughs> Ikaw na rin Yung ano, yung... Kasi sa dami ng dynamic chapter sa buong mundo, actually makagawa ka na isang bansa. <laughs> uh, so, how do you... Ano, kasi nga sa dami ng dynamics, paano mo na hahati-hati na makapag-interact sa bawat chapter? Actually, when I travel to their countries, boy, I I like to spend time with them and I like to hang out with them as well. Katulad po nung ginagawa ko nung sa Abu Dhabi, sa Dubai, uh, sumama po ako sa Ferrari World sa kanila and then sa Singapore naman, they toured us sa Universal studio so it's fun na po and then dito sa Philippines syempre get to meet them sa meet and greets and also sa sa concerts and uh, final question na lang uh, yung, yung isa sa naging viral uh, song mo is yung Chandelier na kinata mo doon sa uh, Wish so um, are you also planning of doing another something viral again para yun nga Yeah, dag dag ano. Hindi ko pa wala kasi yung chandelier didn't really expect it to go viral as well. And hindi ko po alam kung ano gagawin na viral ulit. Pero sana po uh, makagawa ulit ng kanta na mag-go viral ulit. Thank you. Thank you po. Question na lang. Um, I understand that in your album you've worked with several composers, uh-huh. you've abroad, pa. so can you walk us through those, some of 
songs, how the collaboration was like. Yes, well, actually most of them are foreign composers, but the Seven Minutes was composed by um, someone named Sir Mark. Sir Mark was the name of no? He composed on Seven Minutes. And then the style I thought of was a Singaporean composer, which I met last week long ago. And, um, the number one group is Singapore, and then uh, the parachute. <coughs> I was not sure if I can compose it because I haven't walked through it. But um, the pusha. <laughs> and then Ang Kang Hello was composed by me, and then Alam was composed by Sir Junji Marcelo, and then. Yung Be With Me was composed by <laughs> Sir Kiko Salazar no, and then Ben Putai, obviously. <laughs> and then Talk About Love was composed by Sir Chris Contigo, and then My Baby and Me was composed by Alan Eshu, Is, and Marco Rapascal, and Marusha Retana Pansen. And then Yung Surrender Po actually was a composition by Kuya J.R. Silona, and um, Flavomatics of New York, so you mm -hmm. put and then home was by me again. There is any song from the list that um, specifically states your current state of mind? What song is that? Mm, Siguro po parachute or surrender or be with me, because yung Parachute Paul talks about just being free and being who you are and not really caring about what anyone says about you. And then the you know, surrender Paul is also about no, not not really having any negative thoughts on, on in your mind and just relaxing and um, taking a break from all the Busy All the busy schedules. Parang yung sinasabi ng surrender and then yung be with me, syempre po. Uh, I want the Dianatic Split to be with me throughout my journey. And last time, um, talking about being free, um, do you feel um, suppressed in terms of how you post um, like your feelings or pictures in social media because kung ano yung pwede mag Tao, kasi mga bashing that you could probably do that. Siyempre po sa social media, hindi naman po may iwasan yung pag-bash ng tao. And you also have to think before you post din, siyempre. And then, uh, that's pretty much it. Um, may bash, if there's any bash na nasabi sa'yo that you you wanted to clarify that it's not true, ano ba? Marami pong nagsasabi na, uy, bakla si Dan, or yung gay. Like to say, nakakatawa sila kasi, I know who I am, and alam mo kung hindi ko ako bakla. And it's funny kasi, they take the time to bash. And then, parang, it's kind of weird kasi when you go, I, I actually go mismo to their feet and look at themselves. Parang, it's not really, anong tawag dun? Sorry po ah, it's not... Hindi eh. <laughs> Pag po ang mata ako sa feed nila, parang... Parang, parang yung comment nila mismo. Yung comment nila mismo, parang yun na sila. Ah, <laughs> Tapos, pag po ang ako yung bayo nila, ano, be who you want to... Treat others as you would want to be treated. Parang ganun po, and then yung iba naman, be kind to the world, mga, yung mga Bible na phrases. And parang, kung ganun yung bio mo, ba't ka magbabash and take the time to really try and hurt someone naman. So yun po. Thank you. So, um, since, uh, People refer to you as a young a musical genius. Do you actually plan to delve into composing since you're studying music formally um, right now? Um, actually, po yung 
Hanggang I Will Owen Homer, two of my compositions in my current album. So, Pwede bang magpa-sampler ba? Uh, Album sampler, mini lang. <laughs> okay. Uh, in Carrier Shingle ko po, which is 7 minutes. Ayun na lang. 